we're here in Supreme Commander 2. Um, now we're at the Chapter 3 Cybern campaign. We're playing through on hard, doing the hidden objectives. So we're going to start off with the first mission, Fact Finder. Alright. Dr. Snyder has finished her analysis of the Shiva Prime data. Can you summarize her findings? The technology we discovered earlier is an advanced propulsion system that is well beyond our own capabilities. I see. Her current theory is that it allows Shiva to travel great distances in a very short amount of time. That is most fascinating. However, I have made a breakthrough of my own. I have discovered how Shiva Prime operates. As we know, Shiva Prime is an advanced terraformer, a planetary eco-synthesizer. My current theory, which is supported by Dr. Snyder's findings, is that the eco-synthesizer traveled between systems creating habitable planets. What makes it more advanced than our terraformers? Ours work very slowly and only on certain classes of planets. This technology can make any planet in the universe habitable, assuming it has a nearby sun. I didn't realize the Seraphim had this kind of technology. Shiva Prime has existed for much, much longer than the Seraphim. So who or what created the Terraformer in the first place? Chicken egg, my child. Chicken egg. Speaking of which, I heard this interesting story. Father, I'm picking up another commander. It would appear you have an unwelcome guest from Altair 2. You should leave, quickly. This is not a good sign, my child. Not a good sign at all. Who's come through the gate? UEF or Illuminate? Neither, I'm afraid. It is Commander Gage, a former child of the Cybrid Nation who disconnected himself from the Node many years ago. I will prepare for combat. No, my child. I must first secure the findings from our research on the planetary eco-synthesizer. I need you to protect the protobrain complex while I download all of its data. Upon the completion of the download, I will initiate a self-destruct sequence on the site. It is approximately 637 zettabytes of data, and will take some time. I may need to free up some space on my server. Oh, yes. Download initiated. Alright, so... There's a few things you need to start doing right away in this mission. Um, actually, probably was a little bit slow. Um, so pause it. We'll start building some turrets just like how I am. Um, we want point defenses three um, next to each mass generator and spaced out pretty much exactly like I'm doing this. Um, and this is because this mission is going to be a major pain. In fact, I'm going to take the moment to save right now. Right, let me. It would be a good idea to deploy some shield structures to protect the site while I retrieve the data. New research options are available. Alright, I wanted to wait until they're done talking. Okay. Now, the idea why this mission is so difficult, and I'll try to get into this as I go along here, is that basically the secret objective is to withstand a massive onslaught at the end of this mission, which already is pretty much a massive onslaught all on its own. Um, because this entire mission is you trying to defend this base. Uh, you're just getting constantly effed up by, or fucked up by, <laughs> um, If it isn't cyber. Ivan Brackman, I remember when you were a small, gelatinous blob in one of your father's exo-wounds. 
Ignore this troubled siren, my child. Alright, send an engineer there to kind of help repair things. We're gonna need a couple of energy generators. Over here. And we're gonna need an engineer helping out with these uh, mobile shields. And you're just gonna build an endless supply of the mobile shield generator, guys. Um, and they're gonna be really useful because they're basically AA, anti-missile, and a shield generator all in one. Um, so you want to start kind of rallying them next to these turrets. Alright, you're going to take build time. You want to get build cost for structures too. Here comes the air. Commander under attack. And uh, we can start picking up the metal that these planes are dropping as they get shot down. over here. Commander's gonna need to be up front, picking up uh, all sorts of mass here. Need to rebuild that. Uh, this mission's really rough. Starting to look a little bit better. Send another engineer to help out with the uh, shield generator, guys. Commander under attack. Start working towards the shield generator structure, which you're going to need. Rather desperately. Download is twenty five percent completed. All right, let's build a research station over here. Let's pull this engineer back. Got it. Let's start popping shield generators up. Commander under attack. Alright, let's get the commander over here to the left side. I do enjoy a good shield. Oh, yes. Be sure to construct them near important structures. Alright. 
now we need to start working on unlocking the Megalith too. So it's going to be kind of our meal ticket here. Alright, get the commander harvesting crap. Build this turret. Commander under attack. Alright, you shield generator guys you need to come down here. Alright, finally that shield generator is getting put up. These guys are great anti-air. Ask Dr. Brackman why he banished me from the Cyber Nation. Right. Commander under attack. You come back down here. Some more engineers. Let's unlock the Megalith The tube. Megalith can be constructed at an experimental land factory. Let's get an engineer over here. Commander under attack. And another one building a few energy generators. Because those are going to be necessary. Commander under attack. Alright, let's get the commander back here. And let's start placing more shield generators. We want shield generators protecting the shield generators. We're gonna you'll eventually see how we're gonna have an insanely overlapping um, defensive base here. It's really important to have this like shields on top of shield stuff. Alright, let's get this experimental gantry built. Shields also means allowing our engineers to get closer to the wreckage they need to soak up. There we go, that's the experimental gantry. Let's get four engineers on this uh, land factory here. Give them their damage boost. Download is 50% completed. Start working on structures. Commander Gage is increasing the intensity of his attacks. I believe he will overextend his resources, making him vulnerable to a counterattack. Focus on defending the proto brain, Ivan. Yes. These transports suck because uh, they can't be destroyed. These guys back. All right. These two engineers. This needs to build uh, Megalith nonstop. Commander under attack. Now, you, my friend. We're going to add to the point defenses and then start building racks of anti-air.
Shields to the rear of our base, prevent that from happening again.
Download is 85% completed. Shields are going to make the difference here. I definitely need more engineers picking up wreckage. I think a lot of them are getting shot, but it's kind of hard to tell. Download is 90% completed. seem extreme but when you see the size of the force that we're expected to withstand you'll kind of understand why I'm going to such lengths as I am here. at the end here. Download is 97% completed. Alright, that's kind of the signal. The download has completed. Exit through the gate as quickly as possible while I initiate the self-destruct sequence on the base. Father, I should stay and fight. Trust me, my child. Your time will come. Now is not that time. Right, now we will return shortly with additional forces. I have ample mass deposits. I have enough of this talk. You're not ready. As you wish, Father. Alright, so. Secret objective here. Withstand this attack until the secret objective pops. Um, you must I think on lower the difficulties, the attack actually ends at one point, but in this case, the attack doesn't actually end, so. Don't expect it to. And. This is only the start. See this multiple layer shield defense is starting to pay off, not to mention the absurd amount of AA turrets. But even with all that, I'm losing some structures as you can tell.
are facing only two Soul Ripper 2s. Oh, no, there you go. <laughs> the wave of six of them at once. That's the brutal one. shield up. Lost a few as you can see. However the defenses are holding for the time being. Who knows how long that'll last for though. Yeah, that's a problem. Land units running inside the shields. It's kinda hard to stop right now. Start to get Ivan towards the rear of the base. <laughs> you can just see how ridiculous this mission is. Get out of my way. see more and more waves. <laughs> it's not over. Yeah, send that. The gate is charging. I have initiated the self-destruct sequence of the base and will destroy the gate after you have passed through it, so Commander Gage will be unable to follow. What next, Father? I have received a distress call from Dr. Snyder. We must make our way to her facility. It will take a few jumps to get there. Operation completed. Alright. And that's a wrap for the first cyber mission.